everybody, it's Crafting Journey here, that Journey Chick on Instagram. I have a craftably unboxing. So excited. This is one that I pre-ordered uh, back a couple of months ago when they had that huge uh, pre-order. And uh, many of you have, uh, as you know, I'm doing Year of Alice, and many of you have asked, what are you going to do next year? Well, once I open this, you're going to know, because this is not an Alice. So let's get into the box. I have had this box now for a week, um, and just life happens, and you get busy. And But I'm dying to see this thing in person. It's so cute that they use their own little craftably tape on the box. Now, Craftably is a company located out of Texas. They actually have a physical store um, that, you know, I'm not in Texas, but if I ever get to Texas, uh, I would have to go visit. Yes, oh, absolutely. My sister lives in Texas. So I don't know how close she is to the Craftably store, but we might have to make it like an on the way thing, you know, to go visit that store. All right. Oh my word, look at this, oh, I was not expecting this. This, guys, this is a plastic tube, and it's in um, this beautiful wrapping paper, and it has a strap that you can carry it with. Did I order that? I don't remember. It also has the painting. <laughs> Like, it's attached to the string. I don't want to show you the painting yet, but there's there's a little string attached, and there's a picture of the painting. This will be amazing to take to the retreat to put whatever painting it is that I plan to take to the retreat in October. Awesome. I, someone's going to have to tell me if this is standard with Craftably or... Did I order it and no, don't remember? <laughs> Which is entirely possible. Because, um, like I said, this was a pre-order from quite some time ago. Sorry for the crinkling, guys. But the only thing better would be is if it was in pink. My next favorite color, color is uh, purple, so it's okay. Purple and blue. All right, we're just going to rip it off here we go the cats are going to come play we're going to take the picture off so um you don't see it i know you're supposed to leave it on i know i know i probably should have left it on huh look, look at that and you can make it different sizes here you can adjust the size of the tube you just twist it and it opens i think wait a minute hold on Wow. Okay, you twist it and lock it. Um, so you open it from the end. Oh my goodness. This is very sturdy. Like that tough plastic that uh, they make kids' toys out of. All right, so how do I get this off? Just unscrew it. Oh my God. How cool is that? You know, I don't have to go on a plane, but if you had to go on a plane, how perfect is this? You could put this right up into the overhead bin um and that would be so cool look at this toolkit bag oh my goodness all right we gotta look at this guys oh my gosh now i have had one craftably diamond painting it's an alice i haven't done it yet it's an alice van gogh but uh it didn't come in a tube like this and it didn't come with this gorgeous branded toolkit bag isn't that beautiful so what's in the toolkit let's take a look oh my goodness guys lots of stuff this gorgeous washi tape look at that two different rolls of washi tape and there's plenty to go all the way around your diamond painting what is this it's a cover miner no -uh. stop Oh my God, it's a little like, um, like a teardrop. Look, how cute is that? 
cover minder. I'm going to put that in my little bin of cover minders there. So you get two uh, trays of wax, and they're also branded craftably. The cover minder came in this little, like, um, it reminds me of what you would have earplugs in. <laughs> yeah. Don't put the cover minder in your ear. Nope. So you get um, a white tray, a nice pen with a thin four placer. You guys know I love my thin four placers. I, I really like them over the metal four placers. I think they hold the wax much better. So you have a sharp uh, set of tweezers. And what else is there? You get a squishy and uh, there's some more placers in there. So you're also getting an additional four placer. So two four placers and a seven placer and some more wax. How nice is that? And the plastic bag is also branded. Very, very nice. Wow. I'm impressed. And, uh, this is really nice. So out of all this, you know that I um, I like the four placers. The so I'm going to use the placers. I'll probably use the wax. See, we could take all this to the retreat. I could take put one of my. Um, Oh, I don't have purple. I could put one of my Archer's Arts trays in there to take to the retreat. Put some more wax in there. Take my washi tape, my tweezers, and I'm all set to go to the retreat. Look at that. Oh, yeah. I don't use the white place, uh, the white trays or the pens. So that will just go down here in file 13. Okay, what do we got? Tell them what she's won. We have a diamond painting. What is this? What is this? Ah, hopefully it's, I don't know. I don't know what it is. Maybe my inventory sheet? It's, I can't really get it out of the tube. Oh, here we go. Oh my goodness, would you look at this? This, I'm impressed with this tube. Really impressed. I just don't want to lose the lid. I have kittens running around the house right now. So you get an explanation of how to diamond paint. If you are new to diamond painting and this is the kit you ordered, you should be thrilled that everything you need to diamond paint is in this kit. So cool. So, oh, here it is. It says you're new. 4.0 kit features the telescoping art tube. So it did come with this tube. How cool. Up to 80 colors, true to size images, licensed artwork, which we all like licensed artwork. Wow. And a tree planted for each other. What? Seriously? A logbook sticker, which I'm not going to show you yet because... I didn't want you to see this. Oh my God, guys. This is 70 colors. Look at this. And it's a sticker. And each color is a separate sticker. And look how clear those symbols are. 70 colors, including four ABs. What? What? I'm blown away. I'm literally blown away. Um, wow. They have stepped up their game. They have stepped. You know, man, they're, they're, they're competing with the big boys. I'm proud of them. Very good job. Good job. All right. So we have this nice, oh my God, it feels really soft, this. Um, outer portion of the canvas. It's taped closed. Oh, I hear the kittens. Oh boy. 
All right, so we took the tape off. All right, let's take out the drills. There's got, oh, there's got to be more than that. There's 70 colors. Come on. <laughs> They're in here. Come on. And guys, they're already in packages. If you don't want to kit this up because it's 70 colors, they're already in little plastic bags for you. Look at that. They're all in plastic bags. You could uh, you could just start diamond painting. So I do want to look and see how those plastic bags are labeled. Maybe I don't want to look. <laughs> they're all so neatly done. Okay, I can just see it from the outside. I don't have to open it up. So this is a round. I got rounds. I don't know that I had a choice. I don't re recall. So um, as you can see from the sticker sheet, um, each symbol has a corresponding number, see, 1 through 70. And then on the other side of the symbol is the DMC number. So on the package, you have... The kit number, that's in the middle. That's that M3, MC3641. This would be MC3642. So if you keep your drills separate from your canvas, which I used to do, but I'm getting old and getting tired of looking for drills. I don't separate them anymore. Um, you would easily be able to find this. But, um, so on each bag of drills is the number. There's, there's 27. So, you know, that's color number 27. You'd look on your sticker sheet and you could see that color number 27 is 791 DMC. And it's that plus sign. So, that is so cool. So, we have all these different colors here. Look at all the beautiful colors in this painting. And it's got pink. I wouldn't have ordered it if it didn't have pink. You know me. Look. Pink. Pink, 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 pink. Where's the ABs, though? Let me see. Where are the ABs? Oh, I think they're right here at the end. Okay, there's a yellow. All right, we're going to open this one because we want to see the ABs, right? Right. Okay. But we're going to be gentle because I'm not putting all this back. I would never get it back the same way it was in. So they're right at the end, so we can take a look. Oh my God, these are gorgeous. All right, so there's four. Did I say three or four? I don't remember if I said three or four. Okay, so you have the round diamond with the iridescent coating on it that gives it this extra shimmer. That's an Aurora Borealis. There's the white. The yellow, isn't that pretty? We've got some orange. And last but not least, we've got lavender. Look at the sparkle. Oh, that lavender sparkle's really, really nice. Okay, so we're gonna try to put them back in the way they came. Oh my word, I, I just don't want, I don't want to show you every single package of 70 drills. Um, so it's just too much. So let's get to the diamond painting, shall we? I want to see which way it goes. Okay. Oh, this looks like the way. So many of you, many of you know, I live in Kansas. This canvas says Kansas all day long okay we've moved to my living room um coffee table because this thing is massive so here we go we're going to put it out here wow it just fits the coffee table look at this guys i see if i can get the whole thing in there i cannot oh my gosh wow all right so it starts over here and it goes all the way 
over here. So we have a schematic on both sides. So we've got the thumbnail here. And it does say that it's 48 by 24, but that's inches. So here are all of the colors, symbols. Nothing crazy. Yes, all 70, good Lord. But look at this beautiful, look at the symbols on the canvas. So clear, so gorgeous, but look at, a <laughs> little bit of confetti there, huh? Oh yeah. So in case you haven't guessed, um, next year will be the year of landscapes. And uh, I'm gonna pick out maybe four or five to do for the year. And this will be one of them. So this is called Summer Storm by David Roddinghouse. Look, there's the image, thumbnail image. So what we have, there's the house at the farm surrounded by foliage. But look at this beautiful sun peeking, peeking through the clouds. I think we're going to have some special guests join us here. Nope. <laughs> the kitten went, <laughs> went elsewhere. So there's a, a farm tractor here. The gate. This windmill here that's attracting the lightning. But look at this huge tornadic activity over here. So cool. Um, and just like, you know, I live in Kansas. And if you see the sky when it starts to look like that, you better take cover. <laughs> and the clouds do get really eerie when there's a storm like that. Look how beautiful. I thought this really um, screamed Kansas. <laughs> now all the animals appear to have been put away for this storm. They're all in this huge barn right here. Yep, they're in the barn. Now here, what do we got going on here? I'm not sure what's going on here. Um, I think it's kind of, uh, I don't know. <laughs> That's crazy. So there's the barn and here's like this silo there. But I just love the contrast of all the colors. There's, you know, a lot of color blocking mixed in with confetti, but not as much as you would see in a Chuck Pinson. I just want to look at the thumbnail, see what that, so even in the thumbnail, I can't really tell, you know, like what's going on there. So, so beautiful. Sorry, I can't show you the whole thing at the same time. So one thing I wanted to do since it did say inches is I want to, I want to measure it. So it's uh, 62 centimeters this way and 130 plus going the other direction. Wow, is this gorgeous. So that will be next year during my year of landscapes. This is, I'm gonna put this, like this wall right here, see the couch? Oh, I wanna put it right there. On this blank wall, yes, I have a blank wall in my living room. <laughs> let's just go down. Let's look at. Let's go down into the storm and look at the symbols. Yeah, I guess you know the closer I get to it, the more confetti I see. But you know that's okay. Wow. You know when you have seventy colors, that's gonna happen. So gorgeous. And those symbols are so clear. I don't see anything confusing. And like I said, you do you have the schematic on both sides. So one on the left, one on the right. So, you know, I'll put it on the drafting table, start one direction and move the other. So, wow, gorgeous. So the ABs are See if there's any in the lightning. Look, most of the ABs 
are in this section here, this sun section. Wow, is that beautiful, absolutely beautiful. I had no idea. It, I was getting 70 colors in this beautiful plastic tube with this gorgeous toolkit. My God, it, this was worth the money that I invested in this canvas. It really, really was. Um, so yes, next year will be the year of landscapes. Now this one, even though it's round, it, it'll go quickly. It looks like there are some large areas of color blocking, um, but gorgeous, just gorgeous. So I think it'll go quickly, but I still think because of the size and the number of colors, this is going to take me a couple of months, maybe three. So. I don't know how many landscapes I will get through next year because they're usually very confetti heavy and they're very large, but this is going to be one of the three or four or five that I choose for the entire year next year. So we are going to roll it back up. So pretty. And I'm, I am going to put it back in the tube for now, um, but because I'm still in the year of Alice when the retreat is going on, I probably will choose a different painting to go into the tube. But wow, is this gorgeous. I should have wrapped up the drills inside there, huh? Well, I'm gonna put it back in the tube. This company is really, they're competing and uh, doing a bang up job, I gotta say, I gotta say. And I know a lot of you who purchased paintings from this pre-order, um, just wow. And these fit so nicely, cause they're not, they're not those huge, large bags, they're smaller bags, but uh, they're filled to the brim with diamonds. And they have nice, you know, just from looking at the diamonds, I can see that the back of the round diamond is very flat. So sometimes you'll have trouble if, the, if it's concave a little bit, then it'll, it'll might pop off your glue. But these seem to be very flat uh, on the opposite surface, the part that's gonna stick to the glue. So that is a good thing. I don't know that I'm gonna get these back in this tube. <laughs> All right, guys, thank you for watching. Um, I, I'm going to have to say A++, you know, on this diamond painting. You know, I am super, super impressed with this company. Um, and I'm going to have to write to them and I'm going to let them know just how impressed I am. Um, I am not an affiliate with this company. Um, I know some people that are affiliates. If you um, want to order a craftably, I, you kind of have to get in touch with an affiliate, find out when they're going to be coming out with more paintings, more pre-orders, um, so that you can get on, get in, and get in on uh, the next group or batch that they have. So, thank you for watching, and I will see you in the morning show with Crafting Journey, Crafting and Crime. Take care, everybody. Love you.